Our camera's on one man. Three goals in three games, a nightmare for opposing defenders. This is EA TV. Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're ready to bring you live coverage of this League One fixture. It's Rovers and they take on Accrington Stanley. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And here's the starting lineup for Rovers. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks or it could be one of the centre-halves. So keep an eye out for that. And so the battle commences. Rovers go forward purposefully. Well, that piece of play very easy on the eye. Oh, and the decision is penalty. A big chance for them to take the lead here. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. Yeah. This to open the scoring here. And the ball is loose. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Oh, not a great touch. And they've lost possession. A good and fair challenge. And Robo's now in a dangerous position, potentially. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case oh, for this. Big moment here. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Might be able to produce from this position. Options in the centre. A low trajectory ball. Not to be this time.
possession changes hands the interception there dangerous looking attack so a throw in here corner kick forthcoming Now sending it in. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Free kick awarded then by the referee. An opportunity to level matters. And the penalty is converted. A goal is his. And now he can exhale. Well, here we can see it again. Keeper's gone the wrong way. And it makes for a fairly easy finish in the end. That's how to take a spot kick. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Crossing possibilities. And cuts inside. Full credit. Wonderful stop. An attack full of promise. Oh, managing to beat him. And it all counts for naught. Now, goal news to bring you from one of the other games. Here's Alex Scott with the details. It's a goal for Steven Edge. It's now 1-0 with 25 minutes on the clock. Thanks as always, Alex. Opportunity to deliver the cross. John O'Sullivan. Well read to ease the pressure. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. And giving it away. Harry Pell. Oh, the threat is there. Absolutely nothing wrong with the idea, but no end product. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Hamilton. And they have possession again. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Must take the lead here. The clearance wasn't decisive. And he's keen on cutting in. And that's a straightforward stop. John O'Sullivan. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? But nothing comes of it. Oh, breezing past him. Can't miss, surely. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is really well taken because he judges the flight of the ball, uses the right technique, and then makes such good contact. That's a clever goal.
So on they go again. Will there be a swift reply from Rovers? There needs to be. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Splendid tackle, and the outcome is a corner here. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? So the corner played into the box. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. That is that for the first half here. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, what an outstanding first half he had. He dictated the play and was a constant threat with his ability on the ball. Surely he's going to be marked a lot tighter in the second 45 minutes. Otherwise, he completely dominate the game. And so the battle commences. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. chance to do damage he must finish well in the end it was rather straightforward for the goalkeeper Stuart well he has to do better there that's a really poor finish well a goal to update you on let's hear about it from Alex Scott yep it's a goal for Luton Town it's all even Stevens at 1-1 with 49 minutes played many thanks to take the lead still a chance and the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save, and then the recovery. Well, you can't argue with those stats, can you? We've had good chances at both ends. The game is being played with great intensity, and it's... Real chance! Just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, there's been so much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fact. Well, he's certainly got ability. A lot of clubs have been in for him, but now he needs to fulfil that potential. He might just have to be patient, though. And time for the change now. Well cleared away. Rovers losing possession. Couldn't keep it. A 
goal has been scored in one of the other games. Alex Scott has the news. It's a goal for Exeter City. They're back level. It's one all with 61 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Has a go. And that's a straightforward stop. O'Sullivan, a foul, but advantage played. An unforced error, you've got to say. Hamilton, and space for the cross. It might end up being a genuine chance. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Shot attempted. Tremendous block. This might be ideal for the counter. And he's broken free. Well, the decision they have made is to make a triple substitution. Now I'm hearing that something has happened in one of the other venues. A goal there. Alex Scott with the news. Yeah. For Luton Town. It's now 2 1 with 73 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Well, this is such a good watch. Both teams have played their part in a great game with plenty of good forward play. I'm sure we'll see more goals before the end. Hamilton. On the ball, Pritchard. Butcher Morgan still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead but not forcing it well he didn't miss by an awful lot McGlynn and the search goes on for a winner time is tight and the goalkeeper under no pressure And Morgan. Charles. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Oh, managing to beat him. This looks interesting. It has to be. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Could be dangerous. This could level it. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Not giving him a moment's peace. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. They're showing good defensive judgment. This could square the game. And it has! Such late excitement. And no wonder they're jumping for joy as we speak.
Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though, going hammer and tongs from the very start. And I think a draw is probably the fair result. Can I ask you a couple of questions? Thanks, that's all the questions we have for you.